form, but uh, on his day, he's a good dog, uh, Mr. Fagan, out there in box seven. He usually jumps well, but he just might find the going a wee bit too tough. Yes, last time out at Invercargill, he actually jumped first, eventually finished sixth behind Jigs Harcourt on the uh, big horseshoe track down there at Invercargill. Very close to a start here. Race number nine. It's the second leg of today's at TAB Double, South Island Champ Qualifier number four. Avalon Command to the check is the second favourite at this stage, Trevor, 440 and 175. We've got the all clear through, so Greyhound's about to go up to the boxes. There is number two, Avalon Command. And uh, well beaten at Ascot. Ascot Park, down there in Invercargill, finished seventh. Down there behind uh, Angel Did, or in a race that was won by Angel Did, but proud of that most impressive winner here at QE2 Park out of box one. He's drawn well again here at two. Interesting runner is number one, Noble Talent. Down from the north, and now with uh, Graham Barron. First start for him. Brilliantly bred by Amerigo Man out of Diamond Ode, an Australian import. See what it can do on the 560 metre track here at QE2 Park. Lined and ready quickly now, race number nine. Pick six, leg number five, second leg in the TAB double, fourth heat of the South Island Champs. With his call, here's Trevor Wilkes. And racing, uh, jumping out well towards the outside there was Mr Fagan. That goes to the front and out wider there, Fiji Baby. Right up handy too as they head for the bend out of the straight. Now is Avalon Command and following those through is Aqua Blast. Up on the outside, Tangil Star. Two lengths back, Fiji Baby. Noble Talents on retreat. It's going backwards. Further back, single Swazi and two lengths, Twisty Vine's got a heck of a job to do at the back. They race round the far turn now and in front at this stage going up Avalon Command and right there is uh, Mr Fagan but here comes Aqua Blast, the danger, zooming through on the inside. They get to the post and, oh, it's a head up, head down, almost a triple dead heat. Aqua Blast in the middle, Mr. Fagan. And water out on the track, Avalon Command, it's a ding-donger. After those, then, we had Tanjore Star, Twisty Vine running on well with single Swazi, and back a bit noble talent back towards the tail. A great finish. Trevor said it a great finish, and not only that, he was tipping out Aqua Blast, and well, I'm in the worst possible angle, but I reckon 372. Let's have a look on the replay as we pick them up. Mr. Fagan, who rocketed to the front, he is in front of this stage, but whipping past them there, the outside is Avalon Command, and in behind them there, through on the inside. The switching off at this stage is Aqua Blast, number three. Behind these runners, Tangier Star, the favourites right out the back. A twisty Vine never in the party, and also single Swazi just too far back. In the straight, Aqua Blast the inside, the white dog and the white rug. Out wider to the check, Avalon Command the second favourite. Between the two is seven, Mr Fagan putting up his best run for some time. Let's have a look at this freeze frame, there's not much in this, it's head up, head down. Who gets in the telling stride? Anybody's guess, anybody's guess. It's even tighter than I thought. Maybe seven's got it at the centre. Could be a dead heat in there somewhere. Could be a triple dead heat, who reckons? I don't know. No one's saying anything here. I don't think they know either. Out of the boxes, let's have a look at the head-on early on. And you can see Twisty Vine very slow to go. Swingle Swazi gets back. Here's Aqua Blast coming across on Single Swazi. She got a bit of a check there. And rocketing to the front is 7, Mr. Fagan. 7-3-2, there they go. 7-3-2. So the dog in front, Mr. Fagan. That's the one that's held on. So uh, Trevor Wolf's going very close to tipping out a real upsetter there. But in the meantime, there has been an upset. Just not quite as big a one. Number 7, Mr. Fagan, a black dog by Chariot of Gods out of a door mist, raced and trained by Tony, Mc Tony Dickens of Methany in Mid Canterbury. And uh, Tony is the president of the Ashburton County Greyhound Racing Club. And he's got Mr. Fagan back to his best. Excellent effort from Tony. Race number nine, dividends from the Christchurch Greyhound Racing Club. We'll bring them to you after the break. What New Zealand radio station has these personalities? And a cast of thousands of New Zealanders, because it's all talk back. Radio Pacific, the talk of New Zealand. Be sure to keep watching for the summer season of bowls brought to you on trackside by SIS Insurance, because no one understands your needs more. Pine Gould Guinness are New Zealand's leading standard bread auctioneers. They conduct the country's major yearling sales in Auckland and Christchurch. Pine Gould Guinness is a long established firm. Their experienced bloodstock team handles private sales, valuations, insurance and of course auction sales. Pine Gould Guinness offers support through sponsorship to the industry it services. Contact the Pine Gould Guinness team in Christchurch on 03 
3433 triple nine.